This one is mine. Hmm. Should have gone a little easier. The name's Alvin, and don't you forget it. So this is certainly logged a good amount of real-world combat experience. Indeed. I feel that I fully understand the fundamentals. The trick seems to be viewing the blade as an extension of my body and swinging it intuitively. That's not one of the fundamentals. That's the final stage of mastery. Oh, is it? Well, I still get frightened every time I fight. You should use that fear to fuel your punches. I do. After all, it's either them or me. If you've taken that lesson to heart, then you're a true warrior in my book. Honestly, I don't know which one of you scares me more. But we must. Already? 
Once we cross the Kijara Sea Falls, we'll reach Niakara, the village of the spirits. At least the soldiers didn't come after us. I hope we didn't make trouble for those villagers. They were so kind to us, too. Well, what else could we do but run? Rashagal's troops showed up. The villagers picked the fight, not us. How can you talk like that? Maybe they were trying to protect us. If you're worried about them, then maybe you should go back. It was a pleasure knowing you, Jude. Thank you for all of your help. How can you be so cold? You'd rather I get emotional? I'm afraid I don't have that luxury. What is it you humans say? I've no time for waxing sentimental. Because of your mission? Precisely. So you think your emotions would prevent you from doing what you have to do? Can a person still fulfill their duty if they become emotional? Only one way to find out. You'd have to try and see. Well then, you should take your own advice. Huh? Just be yourself and do what you have to do. Maybe then you'll have your answer. 